So while Elena's putting the car away, I'll explain where we are and what we're doing. We came down the river, by a port I should say, and I'm in a different boat because we want to be able to travel. So it's horribly windy, it's pretty cold, like it's been 30 degrees lately, but today is cold and very, very windy. But to try and catch giant fish, that's all I want to do. <laughs> Coming in all over the place. Huh? Yeah. Addicted now. Catching these giant barramundi. I won't mind if it's a giant salmon. Uh, both would be even better. But with this wind, don't know. I'm a little bit pessimistic. So when you're chasing giant fish, you only use giant lures. The various versions of the nine inch. So that's a nine inch. Then I have multiple colours. Ten inch killer prawn. So. I'm very keen to see how the Freddies respond to that and the barrel. Then, next size, the 11. <laughs> so we have 9, 10 and 11 inch baits, giant baits, to catch giant fish. So we'll get you later, and let's go. So head down river as the sun comes up. Hopefully we don't have too much wind against tide scenario. That will be horrible. We have a bit of a drive, a bit of a mission. I plan to we go out the front a bit and go up some of the other arms but all depends how rough it is and how much traveling I can do. Still only a tinny so weather permitting. Uh-huh. Oh, good morning, good afternoon, good evening ladies and gentlemen. This is another episode of me not catching anything. So let's go. <laughs> Good morning, good morning. It's a bit windy, but we're still on the mission for a saltwater barra, eh? Let's go! Woo! Life or death. And bomb. We are on our spot just waiting till the monster kicks in and about to start fishing. So here we are, the land of Brahmandi. So my choice today is try those prawns or barra. I reckon that's gonna be my gold color today. Ooh, bit of pink. Sylvester is using his big swim baits. On the background, we have a nice Kurada Shimano reel. Oh, Kurada Shimano. <laughs> and here's the Sylvester. We are still together. We still love each other. Yeah. Fishing. So, Sylvester, tell. Um, the public, what are you doing? The public. I am putting stinger hooks on these big prawns, killer prawns. Changing stinger hooks on my other swim baits to ones that I like. Give myself a fresh one of these because this one has caught too many fishes. So what's your, gonna be your first go-to combo? Not sure, I think I'll try the prawn first just to see their response. Which prawn did you pick? The pink. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Um, people, 10 o'clock. Um, let's see what Sylvester is doing. From my point of view, the prawn hasn't gave me any luck yet. Oh, yeah, because you were dreaming. Um, I wasn't dreaming, I was fishing, 
Boring. We can't hear you though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, actually I was asleep as I'm waiting for the major time which is 11.30. You're not hot in this. Oh baby, that was my Pepsi. Was it though? Let yeah. me get in my fridge. Hmm? Well, I didn't want to wake you from my water, so that was your pants. Pretty sure I already had two in there. What's that? In there. Pretty sure I already had one in there. How many did you bring? One. Well, why would you bring one when there's two of us? There's a barrel. Says you're right. Hmm? There's a barrel there. Come on, record on the video. Biggest barrel. Caught on tape. You bad cats always win, darling. You should take your hoodie off. It's not a winter. You've got to jump. Well, Sylvester is um, prime, so we better save the battery and stop recording till we get something. Hope you had an amazing day. I miss you. Heaps of fish, no bites. Turn, second one I'm gonna be over his back. Third one I can't see. No, it's just four fish I'm looking at. Can't see my wheel, can't see the fish. And they're all gone. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon it's a big thready. I thought my lure was going to be nowhere near him. Did you press GoPro? Huh? Did you press GoPro? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's a big thready. First fish in the boat. Uh-huh. It's not in the boat yet. It's a big one. It's a very big one actually.
the net down. You're gonna do it with iPhone. I just do it with a bit of fishing line. Right, yeah, we can try with the iPhone, but just do it with a fishing line and put it on. Are you filming them? Yeah. Wow, that's so heavy. It's a 20 kilo salmon. At least. This is the first time I see salmon in real life. It's so big, eh? Hmm. I thought it's it would be bigger, but... Slide that net away. You thought it'd be bigger, it's nearly as long as you. Look at how long it is, Charlie. <laughs> Can I have the pliers from up the front? As long as you. <laughs> you hold that on his nose. No, the line. The line. The tip of no, the tip of on his nose. Good? Mm-hmm. When you don't have a brag mat. Can't even fit in the GoPro, that's a good one. Well done. Mission accomplished. I know the problem. Hmm. What color is this? Gold. Yeah, I normally have the silver ones. For Barra. This is gold for Threadies. Well, it should happen. <laughs> oh yeah, you can't say that word on YouTube, baby. Gold for kings, king salmon. Next time, silver. For silver by Monday. Mm -hmm. What about me? <laughs> no, you don't want to know what you catch with that. I'm up here dealing with all these waves and wind. Princess back there. I was gonna yell out, I'm on. Huh?
gone through a couple. I've given up on the prawn. I've still got one prawn tied on. Come back to Old Faithful. Well, guess who's back? I'm back. Hey guys, it's me, Lenny, back in YouTube. On YouTube. Hey, hey, what's going on? A little update, it's 3.30, the tide is changing and we are full mode um, on fishing. Wind is a bit cooled down, so bless me and uh, I don't need to show myself so much, so I show Celestia. So we have seen plenty of barrels here, but uh, no bites. I wonder why. I'm not sure. Let's ask the fishing expert, Sylvester. Huh. And the mic is yours. Oh, yeah. Made a move back, sort of, I guess halfway home in a way, probably not that far. Um, way too windy down there. It was still plenty of fish showing up, but very very difficult with so much current and wind playing against each other to keep on the fish or keep within so that I thought I could actually have a shot at casting at one so made a move to some calmer water and I'll fish the tide change and I'll probably see us out maybe enough of Sylvester more me more female anglers who doesn't fish it is very windy today, but we are not quitting. Um, it's getting close to the bedtime, but we are still fishing. Uh, bedtime is just around the corner, um, but yet we're still here. We still. Um, no luck so far let's hope in the next couple of minutes hours days what's that oh, a big ray or a dolphin jumped out in the middle out there lure change 457 and there's so many fish on the screen where does that thing go? No. What is it? It's called a bomber. I can't. I don't know who makes it. We're still fishing here. Um, so far, just one massive threadfin salmon. Have seen uh, dolphins. We have seen the biggest crocodile I ever seen. We saw just around the corner. It was massive, and it's actually. I show you guys, it's really big. That's oh do you guess so? So funny, it's not even funny. I think I'm more funnier than you. My highlight of my day is seeing the biggest crocodile. So I'm gonna have to leave because the tide has now started coming back in and they're not biting, but to show you what I've been dealing with. Look at them all. Everywhere. Look at them, coming in all over the place. And they have zero interest in my lure, or lures, I should say. That is now my collection. So, giant prawn versus giant plastic. And the plastic one, I guess, because it caught the only fish that I cooked today, which happened to be giant king salmon, but better than nothing, I must say. At least it's not a donut. I am yet to donut here, which is good. Always something. But I'll pack this up and we have a mega journey out of here. So I literally brought this boat with us today just so... Get off these flats. Just so we could deal with the windy conditions and still be able to fish obviously my little four meter would have been hectic traveling all that way and i wanted to explore a fair bit more 
So I've done some exploring, but I think next time I will most likely just accept the conditions are bad and not come. What you think there, darling? Look like a little Eskimo or something. Very happy to be here, no matter how cold it is, no matter how windy it is. I'm happy I'm not, uh, even if I'm not catching anything, I'm still happy to come here because it's very beautiful. We have uh, crocodiles, we have uh, dolphins. Um, I'm just happy with uh, Sylvester's company. Oh, yeah, well, I'm happy with my wrap. Cheers, let's drive back. That was an epic drive back. That was a mission. A lot quicker when we went out this morning, we went around the bottom, but way too rough now to go around the bottom. So we decided to go the long way back. But beautiful view, beautiful sunset. And we're back now and I've tasked for you, Lena. <laughs> we're backing down the ramp because I can't really beach boat on this muddy bank. But she's only once a Florida longer, so looks like she's getting there. Doing well. Apparently they don't have uh, four drives and trailers in Estonia, so she's learning every day. She's doing well. She's learning. <laughs> Good work, baby. <laughs> 